This is the VOA Special English Health Report. In recent years, the world has made progress in reducing deaths among children under the age of five. A new report says an estimated 6.9 million children worldwide died before their fifth birthday. That compares to about 12 million in 1990. The report says child mortality rates have fallen in all areas. It says the number of deaths is down by at least 50 percent in eastern, western, and southeastern Asia. The number also fell in North Africa, Latin America, and the Caribbean. The World Bank and three United Nations agencies worked together on the report. The three are the UN Children's Fund, the World Health Organization, and the UN Population Division. Tease Burma is head of the WHO's Department of Health Statistics and Informatics. He says most child deaths happen in just a few areas. Sub-Saharan Africa and Southern Asia face the greatest challenges in child survival. More than 80% of child deaths in the world occur in these two regions. About half of child deaths occur in just five countries. India, which actually takes 24% of the global total. Nigeria, 11%. The Democratic Republic of Congo, 7%. Pakistan, 5%. And China, 4% of under five deaths in the world. Tease Burma notes that in developed countries, one child in 152 dies before his or her fifth birthday. But south of the Sahara Desert, one out of nine children dies before the age of five. In Asia, the mortality rate is one in 16. The report lists the top five causes of death among children under five worldwide. They are pneumonia, diarrhea, malaria, and problems both before and during birth. Tessa Wardlaw is with the UN Children's Fund. She is pleased with the progress being made in sub-Saharan Africa, the area has the highest under five mortality rate in the world. But she says the rate of decline in child deaths has more than doubled in Africa. We welcome the widespread progress in child survival, uh, but we importantly want to stress that uh, there's a lot of work that remains to be done. There's unfinished business. And the fact is that today, on average, around 19,000 children are still dying every day from largely preventable causes. The World Health Organization says one way to solve these problems is to make sure health care services are available to women. In this way, medical problems can be avoided or treated when identified. We have placed a link to the report on our website, voaspecialenglish.com. And that's the VOA Special English Health Report. I'm Christopher Cruz.